Hello, 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 guys. I would talk, but this music is pretty epic. Well, anyways, welcome to Dragon Age Origins. <coughs> oh, excuse me. This is as much as I've seen of this game. Uh, I played a lot of Dragon Age Inquisition. Uh, I actually... Well, let's, let's just get into the game. I'm so excited. And so is the Golden City, blackened with each step you take in my hall. Marvel at perfection, for it is fleeting. You have brought sin to heaven and doom upon the world. Canticle of Theron Dies, 8.13. The Chantry teaches us that it is the hubris of men which brought the Darkspawn into our world. The mages had sought to usurp heaven, but instead they destroyed it. They were cast out, twisted and cursed by their own corruption. They returned as monsters, the first of the Darks. They became a blight upon the lands, unstoppable and relentless. The Dwarven kingdoms were the first to fall, and from the deep roads, the dark spawn drove at us again and again until finally we neared annihilation. Women from every race, warriors and mages, barbarians and kings. The Grey Wardens sacrificed everything to stem the tide of darkness and prevailed. It's been four centuries since that victory, and we have kept our vigil. We have watched and waited for the Darkspawn to return. But those who once called us heroes have forgotten. We are few now, and our warnings have been ignored for too long. seen with my own eyes what lies on the horizon. Maker, help us all. Well, that was an intro. The background you select will determine which of six distinct opening stories you play through. It is also affects how characters respond to you throughout the game. Oh my god, there's character creation. Okay, well, hello, hello, hello. 
again. Hey guys, it's uh, Shibubi here, and I'm going to be playing Dragon Age Origins. I am a man. I will be playing a man. And, uh, I want to be human, elf, dwarf. Hmm. Two willpower, two magic. Strength, dexterity, magic, and cunning. I think, I think I might go elf. Elf rogue, ooh. That's, oh, oh yeah, that was the other thing. I haven't played any of Dragon Age Origins. Um, I played a whole bunch of Inquisition. I actually had got it just after uh, winter break. And so during the Christmas uh, holiday, I, I played it for like four days straight and like completed the campaign. <laughs> there was nothing, I, I did nothing but play Inquisition. And then uh, I hadn't, also hadn't played much of Dragon Age 2, but um, I did actually, I did play um, a little bit, uh, but I didn't get very far. I, I kind of fell out of the story. I wasn't really interested. And then Dragon Age Origins, I kept getting this recommended by my, um, my cousins and the reviews have been great online, so, I mean, definitely something I should have checked out. Well, that's what I'm doing right now, so hopefully you guys will join me on this epic saga. Let's see. Should I, should I go with the rogue? That's what, that's what I did in the other game, in Inquisition, and I feel like I should try something else. Maybe I should go mage. I'll just... I won't use daggers this time, I'll, I'll go for the bow. Greetings. Oh jeez. Too many options. I could be here forever. Pretty good. I don't like that. It's more human looking though. Oh jeez. That's a lot of facial tattoos. Go for a light stain color though. Hair. Ooh, I like that. Let's see what else we got. It's so dark. I can hardly see it. What a braid. The elves are always far too pretty that I like that hair. I kind of like the white as well. I, I always, I always make my characters have the, the super white hair. They seem more mystical. Some dark eyebrows, eyes. That's too much. Nose. That's too much. <laughs> we'd, be, we'd sit here forever if that, if that's what I was gonna do. Neck and ears. That looks fine. Portrait. Oh jeez, you can alter that. I want him. I want him to face. Just right on it. Maybe we should have him. Yeah, that looks good. Go for purple. <laughs> oh jeez. Yeah, we'll give him this like funky. Happy, quirky, and his voice. Ooh. No, it is gone. How do you do? Greetings. Greetings. Charmed, I'm sure. Greetings. Oh, my spell. What does it take to kill these things? This this voice doesn't sound violent to me. It sounds more like. You're in my way. It's just kind of childish and arrogant. How do you do? 
We'll go with cocky. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Okay, well, what's, what's cunning do? I'm sorry, guys. I'm like a total noob, and I, I need to like go through this to make sure I make good decisions and things like that. Okay, cunning determines how well a character learns and reasons. Most skills, such as herbalism or combat tactics, require a quick mind to master. Rogue's benefit and dexterity, I, I think, I bet, is the other. Yeah, so we'll go some dexterity, and we'll put the rest in cunning. We don't need strength, I think. Constitution? Nah. We'll just have to be super skillful. Oh, jeez. Even more. <laughs> oh, god. Okay, let's see. Um, character is influential enough to convince others to change their views. Strength contributes to a more intimidating character, whereas cunning contributes to a more persuasive character. Stealing, trap making, improved survival, combat training, or combat tactics. I think I'll just go with co coercion. I like being able to persuade people to my side of the story. Oh, we can't do archery. Oh, we need combat training? Oh, we don't have any of that. Dirty fighting, below the belt. Deft hands. Bonus to picking locks or stealth. The rogue has learned to fade from view, taking any action beyond movement, including engaging in combat or using items will attract attention. Yeah, we'll go with that. That sounds good. Oh, we get another point. Awesome. Okay. Uh, below the belt or... I think Deft Hands is good. And we will just play on normal difficulty because I'm a noob. Left click on any of your characters to take control of him or her. Try positioning each of your characters tactily. Move rogues into a backstab position or you move archers to a hill. You were born amidst the Dalish Elves, noble wanderers who refused to join the society of humans that subjugated their homeland so long ago. The Dalish traveled the land in tightly knit clans, struggling to maintain their half-forgotten law in a human world that fears and despises them. You spend your time hunting with your clanmate Tamlin in the forests, and as is sometimes the case, your quarry is not always the local wildlife. It's a Dalish! And you three are somewhere you shouldn't be. Let us pass, Elf. You have no right to stop us. No? We will see about that, won't we? I was gonna say, You're is that me? Time. I found these humans lurking in the bushes. Bandits, no doubt. We aren't bandits, I swear! Please don't hurt us! You Shemlin are pathetic. It's hard to believe you ever drove us from our homeland. We've never done nothing to you, Dalish! We didn't even know this forest was yours! This forest isn't ours, fool. You've stumbled too close to our camp. You shems are like vermin. We can't trust you not to make mischief. What do you say, Lethalon? What should we do with them? Oh, jeez. Okay. KILL THEM! What do I care? The others will never know. Let them go. You judge humans too harshly. Let's find out what they're doing here. Give them a warning. Killing them will only bring trouble. Uh... Hmm. I feel like... It's unfair to sort of pin these three but if they're up to no good let's find Does out what they're matter? doing hunting or banditry we'll need to move camp if we let them live L look we didn't come here to be trouble we just found a cave yes a cave with ruins like i've never seen we thought there might be uh treasure so you're more akin to thieves than actual bandits hmm you should have treasure to prove it. Ha, huh? I'd like to see these ruins. We know this forest, there are caves, but no ruins you lie. Well, I don't know that. <laughs> uh, ha, huh? I'd like to see these ruins. Um, yeah, I'd like to see these so ruins. So would I. I've never heard of ruins in these parts. But I, uh, I have proof. Here, we found this just inside the entrance. The stone has carvings. Is this elvish? Written elvish? There's, there's more in the ruins. We didn't get very far in, though.
There was a demon. It was huge with black eyes. Thank the maker we were able to outrun it. A demon. Where is this cave? Just off the west, I think. There's a cave in the rock face and a huge hole just inside. Well, do you trust them? Shall we let them go? Oh, <laughs> these guys are ruthless. Freaking savage. You frighten them enough, they won't bother us. So they can bring a mob to drive us out. I don't think they will Run along us. then, Shems. And don't come back until we Dalish have moved on. Of course. Thank you. Thank you. Well, shall we see if there's any truth to this story? These carvings make me curious. Uh, shouldn't we inform the keeper? I'm not sure. Sounds like a good idea. <laughs> Ooh, tactical. The game can be played from a variety of tactical viewpoints. Use the mouse wheel to bring your camera down to exploration mode. Issuing orders. Oh yeah, this is awesome. Your character now has a move order. You can issue orders in real time or while pause. Press space to unpause now. Aww, oh, sweet. A new party member has joined you. You can take control of this character by clicking on their portrait. Oh, very cool. Let's see. Oh, uh, snap. Equip new items, you'll need an open inventory screen. Do so now by pressing or I. Let's see. Dealish armor, indestructible. Indestructible? To unequip, drag an item uh, from on the left side back into the inventory. Oh, he's naked. <laughs> to equip, drag items from your inventory onto your character. Oh, can I just put it on him? Oh, sweet. Okay. Quick bar. Oh, I should put that. Oh, and there's no jumping. I keep confusing that. Combat basics. You are in a combat situation. Master of the battlefield is important. Uh, what am I combating with? I cannot even... Oh, snap! That is so loud. Oh my god, I am so sorry guys if that was like extremely loud. Oh snap. That was loud. I think that could actually be even a little bit quieter. Jeez. Resume the game. Behind you! I'm off. Yes. Oh gosh, guys. He's just missing his shots. Oh my gosh. I am terrible. Oh jeez, but that was awesome. Everything except for that super loud music. Oh jeez, that was awesome. Oh, dead hala. What's in here? Chest. Gets bow, awesome, we'll take that. Let's see if that's any better. Does it compare it to what I have? Damage five. Rapid aim. Yeah, I guess. Guess it's better. Hope you guys got your snackies ready. I have my coffee, like usual. Mm -mm -mm. That coffee. Ooh, elf root. All right. That I remember from Inquisition being like your potions, I think, or at least you use it to make potions. Oh my god, this is. Huh. Now I know why people liked Origins. Man, this was awesome. This is awesome. Elfruit? Yes, please. Are these the ruins? This must be the cave. I don't recall seeing this before, do you? Um. Nah, let's My check it out. Exactly. With luck, we'll find something that will make us clan heroes. <laughs> clan heroes. We just get killed. 
Awaken in Ancient Evil. Wreak havoc on the world. I think that's what's gonna happen. But yeah, so this character, uh, I've made his voice cocky, so I, I figure like he should be kind of the truth. a little bit reckless. These ruins look more human than elven. We. Huh. Oh, that is awesome. Let's see, is this any better? Requires strength. Okay. Holy shit. <laughs> that gave me a minor heart attack. And they they recover health right after battle, right out of combat. Nice. But I think that was that's just like Inquisition as well. Can we go over there? No. All right. Yes, more loot. Uh, who doesn't love some loot? Let's see. Studded helmet. Is it is it better? I ain't got a helmet. Oh, look at his rinky dink helmet. <laughs> and no, our gloves are better. What did I just run? Yeah, I did just run the wrong way. Oops. Hmm. I hate that they have to do left and right. Left or right. Oh, Jesus. Where are you? Oh, I hate spiders. <laughs> oh, there they are. Oh no, we got trapped. Okay. Beat them up for me. Here I am. You do have your dagger out. <laughs> okay. I think the audio the audio is loud for me. I'm I'm betting that the audio is also super loud for you guys too. So hopefully that is balanced better now. Sorry about that. And he's he's got his daggers out. Why? Well, I guess I guess the game's kind of telling me just Jeremy just go back to your dual daggered rogue. I mean, I'm not complaining. I loved playing my rogue in Inquisition. Yes. Oh snap! I saw it. I knew it. How do I use it? Oh jeez. All right. Dark spawn longsword. Let's mess these spiders up. Jeez, these spiders are so loud. My goodness. Yeah. Oh, is he dying? I'm off. Right. I'm off. My god. Okay, maybe we need to turn it down even quieter because. What in God's name is with those spiders? They're so freaking loud. Huh. Oh, does he have a separate inventory? Amlin. Oh. Oh, that's so Okay, so they share an inventory, so I can give him this. Right? Critical chance, armor penetration, minus dexterity. He doesn't need dexterity. Oh, uh, and I love, I love it when the, they actually physically change. 
like you can directly see the the change in the what am I saying? You can see that it is indeed their um, their they they got new armors. Did we just make a circle? I'm so confused. <laughs> oh jeez. So we definitely been through here. We killed those things. Oh, trap triggered again. Yeah, so we came through down that way. Don't look now. Oh, uh, I'm I <laughs> I saw it. I tried to avoid it. I literally stepped right over it. Oh my gosh. Oh, but this is this is just cool just to explore. Uh yeah, so we we were here. Insufficient skill. No, I want to go explore these holes and stuff. Okay, so we can't go in there. I guess we just go back. <laughs> Thankfully, I didn't step on those traps again. <laughs> they they didn't re reset and reactivate. Take all. Yes, please. Uh, where are we? Bones. I can't believe this. You recognize this statue, don't you? Nope. Enough gawking, let's move on. It's warm, but it's vaguely familiar. Maybe. Why should I care? Back when our people lived in Arlathan, statues like these honored the creators. When the Shems enslaved us, much of that lore was lost. This looks like human architecture, with the statue of our people. Can these ruins date back to the time of Arlathan? Hmm. This isn't the place for a history lesson. It's in it's interesting. We're nowhere near Arlathan, perhaps, but there isn't much left down here. Yeah, it's not the I time. I suppose you're right. Still, the possibility is thrilling. Yes, very thrilling. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, I guess oh, oh you never snap! Touch creatures like those, really. Yes. Oh, is the poison still getting us? Come fight over here. Oh, not run into there. Uh, let's get him back. Uh, take a potion. Also put that on your heart box. Ah, going to be okay. Now you're okay. Right. Come on, finish him off, guys. Yes. Are those walking corpses? This place is haunted. <laughs> you don't say. Yes. All these ancient magics, and you're like worried about. Just a few skeletons. Alright, uh, I think I'll leave it here guys. Uh, hopefully I'll get the audio settings just balanced just right for the next part. And uh, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.